Cześć, tu Janek Ziobro, Jakub Janda, Klemens Murańka i Piotrek Zuła. <śmiech> Skocz już dziś po nasze nowe kolekcje mebli na www.mebleziobro.pl Stefan, this was not an easy competition, probably one of the hardest this season. Yeah, it was quite, quite hard, quite uh, difficult conditions. Yeah, but sometimes we have this, and uh, the jumping from the boys today was for Piotrek was quite okay. Also, Maciek jumped quite good. Have a lot of bad luck first round. <coughs> for Kamil, we had small problem now in the flying. He's always drifting to the left side, and but we are working on it and. Hope to find for Lillehammer better setup so that he can he can fly straight. I think David was quite okay. He had a little bit problem with his back, so he's not 100% fitness. And Angio Bro did not so good jump today. His first round was big mistake. When we saw Kamil in flight today, we were really scared because it was close to an accident. It was all his fault, or was it also something with the wind conditions? No. No, no. It is was. <coughs> I don't know 100% now, but something is wrong in his system with skis or, or boots or bindings. Uh, but yeah, we checked everything so that <coughs> everything is clear, and we found solution for for tomorrow in the training. We will try something, and I hope we can find a good setup for him that he can s <laughs> fly straight. <laughs> Because he has been struggling with this problem already for quite some time, uh, not not only here in Oslo. Yeah, it was. <coughs> this problem was coming, uh, so and uh, last months I think a little bit and a bit more and more, and now it's so big that it's, it's disturbing him totally in, in the in the air. And yeah, uh, we we work on it, and sometimes it's not so easy to find find out why why it is it is like this. But yeah, as I said, we we try to find it. <laughs> But you suspect equipment, not uh, not uh, what something he's doing. Uh, I think he's jumping quite well from the from the takeoff, and so this is okay. It's normal. It's in, it's good. But I never saw Kamil with problems like this in the air. Also not in the summer training. You never have this these problems and so this show me a little bit so it's maybe more on the material side. Today in the second round Maciej really advanced so many positions we were amazed he was almost in top 10. Was that good jump in the second round? No yeah, it was a quite normal jump in the second round. Uh, he had so bad luck in the first round so he had total no chance to fly far and then but <coughs> the jumps are today for Maciej was, was, was quite good. It was good jumping and But he has this bad luck, like also Preots had bad, bad luck first round, also fourth fun, so yeah, it's a bit strange competition. Yesterday we lost the second place by half a point, it was really l very close and again many people complain about the style marks, because for them Maciej did not really get really, really as good style marks as he deserved in the second round. Yeah, I, <coughs> I see it different because uh, we're losing too much in the first round. So there was not not good enough jumps from um, uh, Maciek, was not good enough jump from David and not good enough from Kamil. So that's why we was on the third place, not because of judges. So you don't never blame judges? <laughs> no, because they make his job so good they can and we make our job so good we can. And first we have to show on us how was it and, and then we can look for the judges. You happy this part of we, uh, row air is over the Oslo that we are leaving this place? No, I have total no, no problem here. I think this hill it's it's good hill, and the conditions are always hard here. And it's but this is for everybody the same. So I'm focused on the on the jumping on the quality of the jumping and the quality of the jumping here was sometimes good, sometimes not so perfect. But okay, the athletes are not machines who can do and every weekend the perfect job and. We will stay on our system, on our technique working and, and hope that we can do on the next session a bit better. So last question, is it difficult for you as a team to cope with everything logistically, to move almost every one or two days to a different town here? No, no we are good organized for this and, and we have also our own car here for the for the hardware, for the skis and, and waxing boxes and, and, and so. So I think it, 
It's uh, good organized. So what I hear from the team captains meeting, everything is, is organized good and I think we should take this organizing and, and just go to the next place and, and be focused on ski jumping. So you all keep calm and stay focused and there is no sudden, I don't know, nerves that um, Kamil lost his bib and we have to move, do something quickly, you know? <laughs> no, no, no. No, so this is working. What? So <coughs> the last last weeks or last months was always really good for us. We had total no problems, boys jumping good. Now we have small problem with with Kama his flight and, and also with David his back is not perfect. But yeah, this is big challenge for us and it's it's will show how strong is our team when it's uh, uh, some problems. Thank you very much and I wish you solve all the problems. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you.